Josh Smith with GottaBeMobile.com. Today we're taking a look at the Galaxy Note 2, the Galaxy S3, and the iPhone 5. These are three of the most popular smartphones available, and for good reason. They're available on AT&T, Verizon, Sprint, and many others. With these devices, we get a range of screen sizes, 4 inches, 4.8, and 5.5. And with the really large screen on the Galaxy Note 2, we get some extra features. If I pull out the S Pen, it's a small pen that tucks into the back and allows you to take notes and draw, but it also allows you to hover over the screen to move around, to view more information about certain things, and you can take notes, take screenshots. It's a handy little accessory. Another really cool feature is the ability to look at two apps at once on the screen. So if I hold the back button here, I can pick two different apps, pick the internet, and we'll also grab a Twitter app. And we can use these two apps side by side to do more at once, work on things while catching up on our Twitter feed, scroll through, and you can use each app independently. The Galaxy S3, we have our 4.8 inch display, and one of the really cool features here is while you're using it, while you're looking at photos or the internet or reading something, it can detect your eyes and the screen won't go black while you're using it. We expect the multi-window feature will come to this one very soon. The iPhone 5 features a 4-inch Retina display and a lot of people like this over the iPhone 4 and 4S because the display is larger so you can view a little bit more on the screen at once and it still remains pretty easy to use with one hand. The Galaxy Note 2 can be a challenge to use with one hand but it's not impossible and we're finding that some users prefer this bigger screen because it's easier to either blow up your text or just read it because it's on a larger screen and a lot of people will prefer a two-handed touch when typing out something like this. We're seeing Samsung make a big push for the employee market with bring your own devices and with work devices by offering up a lot of cool technology that businesses want on their employees phones. So one thing that users will note is the iPhone 5 has an aluminum and glass back. The aluminum is here and there's glass down here to help with reception issues. And the Galaxy Note 2 and the Galaxy S3 both have plastic backs. Now one nice thing about these are they both come off. And with that, we have access to a battery, so we can put in our own battery, a second battery, a larger battery, third-party batteries that extend the battery life well over a day. We also have access to micro SD card slots, so even though you can pick a couple different size variations in terms of storage, you're not stuck like you are with the iPhone 5. There's no way to add more storage to the iPhone 5. Here we can add in 32 gigabytes more of storage for maybe around $20 by purchasing a micro SD card on Amazon. So head over to GottaBeMobile.com and check out more about the Galaxy Note 2, the Galaxy S3, and the iPhone 5.